Hello, hello guys, this is Pokeland Legend Tips with another video. And before we move into the real deal, please subscribe to the channel, drop a like. If you have any questions, you can ask us in the comments, or even better, join us on Facebook. The link is in the description below. So what we're gonna be trying to do today is uh, try to refine some of uh, our gym calls. So we have a lot of uh, refine points and I thought today video to show the struggle in making these uh, refines really good so uh, yeah they're all legendary but uh, yeah uh, sometimes you have to choose between for example P defense or special attack so yeah uh, we're gonna make a tutorial about that so this is gonna be a long video really really long video since uh, it's an error and try process and I'm not doing a uh, really uh, I'm not showing you guys any really quick tricks. I'm gonna do this live. So, uh, yeah, don't be disappointed if uh, you see that the video is too long. Uh, so, um, here we go. Let's start. So, now we are refining. We are trying to go for special attack or P defense. Uh, I would definitely, in this, like in this case, as right now we have. Yeah, actually, we, we, we're not going to refine this anymore. We have a special attack of 124, which is great. And uh, the P defense is 103. Uh, but actually, this is okay as well. So I would actually go for this. Since we lose a little bit in attack, but we gain a perfect P defense. So that's, uh, that's perfect. And now let's go for the next one. I think there is two. Yeah, this one is especially low. So let's go for this. So they are, both of them are over 125. So what we are trying to do here is try to increase both in a manner where uh, you get... So I'm uploading the event rating as well. So you might uh, see a little bit of lag. Yeah. But this is the only time I can actually record. So... Yep. Uh, so yeah, like I said, uh, we are trying to maximize our our gain while minimizing the loss. So for example, if you have a really high value, let's say a really high value of attack, which is 100, I don't know, uh, 120, for example, let's just take this one uh, as an example. So if you have like this, then right now what we try to do is that uh, we'll try to improve P, P defense while losing as uh, few points and special attack as possible and of course you have to make I mean that's really okay on case basis this is now special attack and P defense if it was speed then it's pretty much another problem that you have to deal with uh, on a timely manner so on uh, mid game if your guys are mid game and you don't have a lot of these points I would really recommend you to uh, refine everything to legendary then stop, then go ahead and uh, you can see now we lose three in atta special attack, but we gain eight in P defense. So if it was the other way around, I would have went for it. So for example, if we do this, we're going to gain a little bit of power. You can see that we're going to gain a little bit of power. See? So now we will try to maximize that again it's because we have a lot of points. If we have everything maxed out. So if it was different, then then that's another case. So now we gain plus two in attack and we lose minus three in P defense. We might take this as well because uh, we do want more attack. You see, we still gain more, more, more power. Since defenses, you can always increase that kind of easy, but attack is really hard to increase. So this is, th is kind of bad since we lose a lot of attack and we gain just few defense. We really don't want to do that. What we want right now is a lot of attack while losing a little bit of defense. So this might be good as well. Uh, we will gain a little bit of power as well in this, see? But not that much because we lost a lot of defense instead. But we are still going to uh, try to uh, free roll for a better for a better attack defense as well. So yeah, I'll try to cross the 100 for the defense as well. That would be uh, good. But yeah, there is a lot of RNG in this, and so far, it doesn't seem that there is any patterns in it. So uh, we are just going to keep going until 
you are lucky enough to meet with a really good uh, role. Sometimes you really have godly roles in this thing. And that's pretty much uh, a process where you have to just stack those points until you rack up a huge amount and keep at it. And at this point, you really don't have to do any. Uh, so this is fine as well. Uh, yeah, we gain. I think we're going to gain a little bit of power with this. Yep. So if we make it 100, 100 if we make if you can if I can make PD funds more than 100 then I would be more than satisfied about this today. So uh let's hope for a good roll in the few turns. Yeah, sometimes it really doesn't really want to go. Uh it doesn't really want to work, so so we'll just uh forget it and let's move to the next one. So now we have to make this better. Wait, what? Oh no, let's make P attack better. P attack with HP. Okay. So again, uh, for P attack or HP, it really depends. Uh, are you using a lot of P attackers? If you are, then you will try to increase P attack as much as possible. So, for example, this one increases both, so that's good for us. Actually, this is a pretty good roll. If I can make P attack more than 250, and uh, more, actually, 50 is too much, it would be really hard to improve this anymore. But let's go for it. I guess the other one is really low, since this one is kind of okay. And HP is kind of important since it's uh, for a lot of Pokemons. Uh, oh, this one is a nice roll. So uh, you lose 13 HP, but you gain 25 in P attack. And P attack has a lower uh, has a lower uh, denominator, so you will gain more power. In case you did not know that. Now let's try for another roll. Of course, you have to choose. Uh, this one is too much. You lose too much in HP. Uh, so you have to choose the correct case on really on case basis. Again, you lose too much and you gain too little. So that's not what we are trying to achieve here. Plus 19 to 100 HP doesn't scale well. Oh, this one is kind of good roll. But... Uh, uh, too much P attack loss. Too much. So 30 P attack for 100. That's again too much. I think it's uh, pretty okay now. I'm very satisfied with it actually. So I'm gonna leave it probably like that. Since uh, we won't be able to increase it anymore I think. Unless we spend the night here. So you gain... This is pretty good. This is pretty good actually. Oh, this is pretty good as well. But this is much better. Yep. As you can see, this is much better. So uh, let's leave that there. Uh, ways... Uh, it was here, right? Then this one. Uh, both are HP based. So let's go for this one now. Uh, train. Uh, you lose 19 in attack. No. No, no, no. I do prefer to have more attack. No. Let's try to make it cross again to 150. While not losing a lot of HP. Hmm, 71 for 13. That's a lot. No, thank you. And, uh, oh, this one is, oh, this one is great. This one is great. Oh, this one is a perfect roll. For now. So I, I'm pretty satisfied with that one, actually. 
yeah, it will be hard to really increase this any further. Yeah, so uh, I'll move to another case. So let's move to this case. There's a lot of stuff here to, to fix. So let's go ahead. Uh, resistance hit special attack. Of course, try to go for resistance and hit. And uh, we're going to do just that. This will remove hit. No, no, this is not a good deal. Actually, uh, oh, wait a second. We have a perfect hit roll there. Oh, this is going to be hard. So we need uh, to increase our resistance while having a decent enough special attack. Right now we do not gain a lot. Now you have three factors, so you really have to take in consideration all of them. The best case scenario is not losing any hit and increasing the others, but that would be almost impossible so what we are trying to aim for here is something like 0, 0.0 maybe uh, 5 loss in hit and while you gain in resistance and p attack and special attack so so far the uh, so far we were not really successful but yeah it's to be expected uh, three factors are uh, is a really really tough situation. So this is this is pretty okay, as you can see now uh, you are losing zero point thirteen, but you are gaining in both. So this is this probably will give you some power, but I will not choose it. I prefer to reroll and see if because I can afford it uh, and see if I can. Yeah, this one was pretty good as, as well. And uh, because we have a lot of points and we have nothing to do with these points since uh, everything is pretty maxed out uh, this is too low 0 0.69 is too low I want something 0 point maybe 89 that would be good 86 but we are losing a special attack so you can see now that the struggle is real and you do need a lot but this is really really high and end and really end game stuff like when you are really maxed out because at some particular uh, at a particular amount of, of a uh, particular moment of time you will be forced to do this uh, to improve in the game oh this is a good role this is, but we lose an attack, but we gain 0 0.20 in resistance. So this is really good. You can see that we only gained a little bit in power and mainly because we lost some special attack, but the resistance that we just gained was pretty good because uh, resistance doesn't really reflect in your power. It reflects in battle. And uh, let's go for something better. So yeah, like I was saying, uh, in end game, in really really end game, like end game, uh, I would define end game uh, or divide it in three parts, like the part where you just reach end game, which is early end game, mid end game, and really really uh, end end game. So this account is really in end end game, while mine is uh, is in about uh, mid or maybe even early end game. So when you reach end end game, you can you can't really do anything to increase your power unless you really and concentrate on this kind of stuff here. You have to get perfect rolls, perfect accessories, uh, perfect. Uh, this is a good roll. And a lot of strike arts. So that's uh, mainly what you have to do. Well, it's really hard to get this kind of stuff here. But I'm pretty satisfied with, uh, with the result we got uh, for now. 
Uh, I wish I could have increased special attack a little bit more, but uh, it's just impossible right now, apparently, without losing too much on the hit, on the resistance. And I always say this, concentrate on the hit, resistance, dodge, and whatever, uh, first, because uh, those, you can't really increase them anywhere else. Uh, it's really hard to increase them anywhere else. While special attack, you can always concentrate on that on ho in home, uh, for example. Uh, this is kind of cool. This is kind of cool. But, uh, yeah, I mean, 1.41 is out of 70. That's a lot of loss right there. But let's take it. Let's take it. Let's take it. Let's keep this like this. And I think there is... Wait. Yeah, I'm kind of not satisfied with that. Let's uh, go for... Oh, actually, Hit has two. Yeah, now we have a new thing to go with. If Hit has two, then we can go back and increase resistance more than Hit. And we can cover the Hit here. Now we have more free attack. This is a good roll, actually. Maybe we can do better. Uh, we lose 0 0.02 and we gain 50 plus 5. Hey, that's a good deal. That's a really good deal. And you can see that's uh, refining. This is just refining the refine. So, uh, and you can see it gives a boost in power. So, so you do have to concentrate on this kind of stuff. Oh, this is almost a perfect roll for a hit. But we do lose a lot of uh, P attack, which we we don't want. So uh, let's keep at it. I don't want to make this video too long, so not to bore you guys. This is kind of good, actually, but uh, yeah, a lot of HP is lost. This roll actually is pretty fine. I can, le I can live with this for now. Oh, this is perfect. This is what we're looking for. Look. You are losing 3 in HP. This is the perfect example of what you need to reach. You are gaining 0 0.06, which is not a lot, but still, uh, in hit, and you're gaining plus 2 in PRX. So if you ask 3 in HP equal to hit 0 0.06 plus 2 in PRX, this is definitely the best deal you can go with. So you lost just a little bit of HP that has a higher denominator and you gained a lot of hit uh, in P attack that have a lower denominator. So that's what you are trying to go for here. So again, here we go. So yeah, if you are pretty bored by now, uh, I'm going to end this video really soon. Uh, I hope uh, I was not too boring. But yeah, this is part of the game that you have to deal with sooner or later. Uh, if you want to keep uh, competing in your server at least. And it's really, really uh, time consuming as well as, okay, this is pretty good as well. You lose in hit, but you gain a lot of HP as well as PR arc. Uh, let's go for this. Okay, so I, I'm pretty satisfied with this right now. Uh, I'll go for dodge, which seem a little bit low. So dodge here with PR arc and special defense. So let's go for dodge. Let's try to maximize dodge as much as possible. Oh, this is good. This is perfect. Let's see if we can get anything better. But I don't think so, because that was a really high value. 0 0.4. Uh, maybe we can do better. Let's see. Uh, this is the ugly part of the game, where you have to uh, keep rolling and rolling and rolling for better luck. Uh, but yeah, 
Actually, this was good. Why didn't this was uh, highlighted? I don't know. You, you have to sometimes really watch out because you don't know how to highlight everything. I mean, sometimes they, these highlighters they are using are some as most of the time wrong. So keep keep watch. At least right now, what we are trying to do is maximize dodge, right? So uh, I'm just going to be looking at all the dodge values and see if any one of them actually crosses the value that I want, which is 40. Okay. So we want more than 40. So this one is 42. So you see, but we do lo lose a lot. Uh, this one, yeah, can be considered good. Now we want something more than 44. So I will definitely go with 40, uh, from 40 to 47 with more attack. So that's that I can that I can go with. So I will keep looking at plus 40. But yeah, this is we lose too much on this. We lose too much on this. But yeah, I will start looking in special attack right now because I want to increase special attack as one as well. So we gain plus five, but we lose minus nine, which is kind of a bad deal. Okay, and I don't see any improvements. No. Uh, zero point, zero points. You lose a lot, you lose a lot. That's almost a perfect roll for special defense. 0 0.80. You lose a lot. I don't even understand why they highlight this kind of stuff. You are losing most of the stuff there. Yeah, the highlighters are definitely glitched or whatever. I mean, for a start, they should highlight every time you are above a certain value. No, you are losing way too much special defense. So, for example, this is 0 040. Uh, no, not now. Bad example. Zero, 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 come on. I don't think we will be able to find, because there's only three other values that are higher than our current uh, position of 0 0.44. So it will take us probably the whole night to try to reach that. So 0 0.45, not with, but I think 0 0.44 is kind of fine. So yeah, uh, let's keep this this way and go for the next dodge. Since there is four of them, this one has crit in it. Oh, it's pretty low, 0 0.29. Let's try to increase that. Now we have to increase crit and dodge. Crit and dodge. Uh, this one will be 0 0.38, 158. Not good. No, no. I would actually train again. Prefer that. This one you lose in attack, but you gain a little bit in both. But uh, this one is no. I prefer not. Let's go for something else. This was imperfect. You gain nothing in first attack, but you gain everything in, in the others. So this one is more to my liking. Oopsie, oopsie. So yeah, uh, uh, well, this then covers our tutorial today. I uh, hope you guys have not been bored and see you later.